The Deltaplex will permanently close its doors this summer. The owner said the closure follows hardships from the pandemic. As we are working to find out more about what could come of the site, we are taking a look back at its history here in West Michigan. News 8's Emily Leonard is live in Walker now with more on this. Emily. Michelle and Sue, long before Van Andel Arena was around, there was the Delta Plex. It was called Stadium Arena, and it attracted crowds right here to West Michigan. And a lot of people here, generations of people, will remember seeing sporting events and shows inside these walls. In 1997, a venue located where West River Drive meets Turner Avenue was transformed from Stadium Arena to the Delta Plex. Joel Langloy bought the building and supervised the upgrades. I, I got to admit that uh, there probably is a little more work here than what I thought there was going to be to start with. But the, the challenge of uh, bringing this from the old barn to what it was, it, to what it's going to be in February, has really been kind of fun. Built in 1952, that old barn held memories of its own. No doubt many people saw their first concert within these walls. Maybe you saw the circus here. Maybe you watched the Grand Rapids Rockets or Owls, both defunct hockey teams that used to call this place home. The Delta Plex has welcomed big musical acts such as Boston and Green Day, emotional reunions of families and their Marines coming home from Iraq, and even a president. In more recent years, Delta Plex has been the place to catch the Pet Expo, GR Comic Con, and the newly named Grand Rapids Gold, formerly the drive. We talked to the gold owner this afternoon about the team's future. We're very appreciative of the years we had there. Uh, and I know the Pistons and Nuggets um, would, would say the same thing. Um, so yeah, it's, 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 it's been good, but I, we are excited about our, our, our future home here. Steve Jabara, from, Steve Jabara from the Grand Rapids Gold telling me this afternoon that they are very appreciative here of their time at the Delta Plex, but they're very excited about their next home too. And that announcement will come in the next week or two. Live in Walker, Emily Leonard, News 8.